Today is February 10, 2017. This is Maddie with your Charger Nation News. Prom is vastly approaching. Any student planning on attending this year's prom will need to purchase a ticket in the library, which are $30, and the pricing will increase after spring break. Prom is at the Lander Center on April 8th from 7.30 to 11 p.m. This year's theme is enchantment. T-shirts will be available for purchasing. Mrs. Hatch is taking song requests for prom, and there will also be a link on the school's website under prom. Don't forget you need your ID to get into prom. Any student interested in bringing a guest to prom that does not attend our school will need to see Mrs. Hatch in the library for prom request forms, ASAP. The deadline for these guests to be approved is Friday, March 10th. When you see these students, please congratulate them for making the I-55 Region Honor Band. Ember Su, Tristan Gooden, Yvonne Benko, Maxwell Stevens, and Jeffrey Byrne. These students attended the Honor Band last Friday on the 3rd. Good job, students. On Thursday, February 9th, our SHS Men's Choir hosted their concert in the auditorium. Thanks for your support to our Men's Choir. On Monday, February 6th, Mrs. Cox kicked off theater practice for Big Fish. The students are working very hard to make this year's spring musical a big hit. This past Tuesday, our sophomores gathered in the cafeteria for information regarding class rings. Representatives will be back on February 15th to take orders. Don't miss your chance to order your class ring. Happy birthday to the following teachers with February birthdays. Coach Carnell, Miss Potsock, Miss Kamler, Miss Pounds, Miss Wilson, Miss Hill, Miss Parks, Miss Almond, Miss Sherman, Mr. Dunning, Miss Manson, Miss Densford, and Miss Gibbs. That's all guys, this has been Maddie with your Charger Nation news. Now I'm sending it over to Shamia with your Charger Nation sports. Thanks Maddie. Last Friday our basketball teams traveled across town to play against DC. Our Lady Chargers won 53-35 and our Chargers won 74-44. Saturday we played against Starksville. Our girls lost with a score of 43-31 and our boys lost 66-58. This past Tuesday, we had another away game, this time against St. Benedict. Boys lost 66-58 and our girls won 52-43. Tonight, our basketball teams will be playing away game against City Hill. JV boys play at 5, varsity girls play at 6, and our varsity boys play at 7.30. Good luck to our SHS bowling team members who are participating in the regional bowling tournament today. Looking ahead on February the 14th, our boys and girls basketball teams will travel to play in the first round of their district tournament. They will square off against Horn Lake. Let's support our Chargers. This has been Shamia with your Charger Nation Sports. Now sending it over to Yanni with your weather. Thanks Shamia. This is Yanni with your weekend weather forecast. Today is a cool and comfortable day with a high of 64 and a low of 56 with 0% chance of showers. Tomorrow's an even warmer day with a high of 70 and a low of 63. Uh, there's a 40% chance of rain, however, so make sure to bring a raincoat or umbrella when you go out just in case. We close off our weekend with a high of 68 and a low of 44. The chance of thunderstorms is a strong 80%, so make sure you're prepared for the worst. This has been Yanni with the weather and have a lovely weekend. Hello guys, today we are with Maddie on Blind Cupid. Maddie, tell us what you're looking for. OMG, thank you so much for having me. I'm here for true love. Well, today I hope you find it. Here is how the game will go. We'll have give you two bachelors and your job is to ask five questions, but you cannot see or hear. Also, the bachelors can't see or hear each other. So hopefully these five questions, you'll find the perfect match. Okay, first question. 
What would you do if I was sick? Well, first I would ask if you need anything. Then I would make you some homemade soup to help you feel better. Seriously? You'd wait till I asked you for help? Bachelor 2. Hope you get better, duh. Really? OMG, you'd have hope for me? You're so sweet. The next question. What is your idea of a romantic date? I would take you to France where you would eat at the top of the Eiffel Tower. Then I would get the best chefs in the world to make you anything you would want. Really? Only France? That's pathetic. Oh, that's easy. We'll be sitting on my couch with the pizza you order. Oh yeah, watching the movie you order too. Oh, don't forget to tip for me. Next question, please. What are you planning on doing in five years? Bachelor two this time. I plan on saying hi to my friend Jack Daniels while you pay off my car. Really? You would let me be independent and take care of you? Bachelor one. I plan on becoming district attorney and marrying you and having a couple kids. Only a couple of kids? <laughs> Really? I want more than that. And D.A., seriously? Pa-the-tick. Ouch, Bachelor One. Next question, Maddie. I have a pet pig. So, how would you feel about me having a pig? Bachelor One. Pigs are for loving and not the oven. Oh my goodness! You would mention an oven and a pig in the same sentence? That's messed up. Oh, 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 oh yeah, I like pigs. Pigs in a blanket. OMG, you want to wrap my pig in a blanket? You're so caring. This is your final question, Maddie. Make it count. All right, here it is. What would be something you would never do again? Bachelor 2. Oh yeah, never take out the trash. So you have a maid? Yeah, you. I would never be on this game show again because you're the one. So you're putting me on a rating scale? <laughs> Bachelors, that was your final question. Maddie, choose your winner. Um, I choose Bachelor number two. <laughs> Bachelor two, are you ready? Because you won. That's When the door opens, you'll see your bachelor. Where's the heart? I thought it was candy. <laughs> now, Chargers, love might be blind, but it doesn't mean you have to be blind yourself to see the right choice this Valentine's Day. Thank you.